how difficult is it, Phil, for a coach to change formation, for him to take a step back and say, OK, not 4-3-3, I'm going to go with 4-2-4 now. Ali Charan's return it could be pivotal for Hyderabad, the turning point. He comes in for the youngster, Rohit Dhanu, who wasn't doing too badly, but uh, it's time for the senior pro to step up. Beche kickstarts proceedings. The freedom to move across that front line. Here's Nanda Kumar. Shubham Sarangi. First time ball in. Oh, missed. And then Diego Maurizio was there. And missed by Nim Dorji. Confusion in there. Like a boot out and won it eventually. Ball went away from Kianese. Diego Maurizio turns and shoots. Almost squeezes one in. It'll be a corner. I love that, mate. I absolutely love that about Maurizio. He's just bouncing up and down. No one... Diego Maurizio now is... His main responsibility is to make those runs. Isak Ralte. Where's the far post? Nanda Kumar. Brings it dead. Nanda Kumar's ball in. Diego Maurizio. Double save, Gurmeet. Wonderful play, I'm telling you, by Odisha and Odisha wingers more importantly. Nanda Kumar was at the far post and the goalkeepers had to make a double save. Maurizio will be disappointed with the second part because I think if he lifts that, the goalkeeper's already on the ground. Nanda Kumar. Pedro Martin. Help comes in from Isak. And Isak is attempted, Isak Ralte! You don't need to look up to see a shooting star! When Isak Ralde is playing on the pitch, that has left a trail of burning purple lights on its way in. One nil to Orisha, well deserved. What a goal this is. What a goal. And that is the moment that Manolo Marcus is sitting down now and thinking, we're riding well up here. We are riding well up. 33 minutes on the field of play, and it's been one way traffic, but it's took a little bit of brilliance. At the same time, fantastic. Diego Maurizio, oh, Gurmeet, palms it away. Straight into him with a lot of power, but a good height. Harmless pass in behind. But again, he has a lovely chance, and that left foot. Yanezi, teasing delivery. And there's the header, and an equaliser. From Nim Dorji. He's had to prove himself time and again at the back. And now he has a goal to his name. One all. His team talk won't change, I don't think. One iota. I think he's going to get after his team for sure. But you're talking about a side who are leading goal scorers from set pieces. And they've just proved it yet again. It's not the first ball, which is a quality ball in. It's not the second one. There it is. Nim Dorji gets on the end of it. And he guides it towards the bottom corner. Do they deserve to be level? Not for me, but they are level because of set pieces, which they are brilliant at. We keep on saying it, if the ball's going to be crossed in, Nanda has to get into that back post area as a winger. He's got a chance to score a goal. So the halftime whistle goes. Odisha have had the half of their lives, but everything is still level. Hence the reason why he got himself a goal. He was driving them forward with his press and he got himself in the box. Whether that's hard work or whether that's quality like a player that's just come on first pass, supplying to Yazia. Jari. Chance of a cutback. Delgado with the defending. Yasser. Past Tene with ease. Hangs it up for Halit Jaran. And Amrinder makes a comfortable save in the end. Jaran's touch was perfectly into his path. And Kianese Amrinder with a save with that right boot of his oh he's got to do better this is a glorious chance an absolutely glorious chance from as close as five six yards away between his legs or however great touch by halichiran round the corner kianese goes past Saul crespo like he's not there and rinder's allowed to make a save there it's an easy save but expected better from kianese just fans will be hoping that their team does not revert to type. Oiva into the feet of Victor Rodriguez. Searches out Diego Maurizio. And Diego Maurizio, it's a narrow angle, runs into traffic. And then the shot. Oh, deflection! And it goes in! Orisha have found a way! 
And it's a weak clearance by Nim Doji that slices it into the back of the net, I think. And there's all sorts of problems there. Look at the bodies that are on the lane. They're trying what they've done all season, to be fair. And it's not a great strike by Nanda. But Nim Doji hasn't sorted his feet out quick enough. And it's gone off his standing foot, which is his right foot to try and clear it. And it's his left foot that's deflected it into the box. Now Diego Maurizio can run at O'Day. He can run all evening. Diego Maurizio. And still Diego Maurizio. A good meet. Got down. Diego Maurizio. In it comes. He's finished it off. Orisha going into sixth. And Mumbai City will have a chance to wrap up the shield tomorrow. But this is a night at the Kalinga which they will remember the defending champions drowning he's been outstanding all game without a shadow of a doubt all season it has to be said and you can see there he's milking it he's milking the crowd because of the work rate he's put into the night's game forget about the quality the work rate he's constantly been in the face of nim doji and a day all night before orisha starts celebrating again here comes the corner and that is that Orisha this season have been like a light that flashes on and flashes off. And at full time, it is Orisha 3, Hyderabad 1.